Oh, you're a vegetarian. So. Yeah, I personally. I eat it. Somebody else. Somebody else. <laughs> somebody else. <laughs> so yes, they're literally just suspending the water like that. Right. So So this is growing year round. I am more than honored uh, to have um, Burkhard Mausberg here of the Friends of the Greenbelt Foundation, as well as, of course, uh, the Premier of Ontario, uh, uh, Kathleen Wynne, as well as Minister of uh, Agriculture, Food and Rural Affairs, uh, Jeff Leal. I just wanted to express why we are so excited with today's announcement. We've been working with the province for the last five years to increase access to local food. And we have made some significant changes. For every dollar that we have invested in the last five years, 13 more dollars of Ontario food has been bought. And that's food that was previously imported. But for me, it's really about the economic opportunity, about the entrepreneurship of farmers and businesses, about the opportunity of an endless market. After all, everybody eats. So now I'm pleased to introduce Jeff Leal, who is the MPP for Peterborough and the Minister of Agriculture, Food and Rural Affairs. And it's always uh, great to be with the Premier of the Province of Ontario, my colleague uh, Kathleen Wynne. And Burkhardt, I want to thank you uh, because your work uh, with the Greenbelt Foundation now is a, a concept, an idea and a commitment that has become part of the everyday language in the province of Ontario. And your leadership has been so instrumental to make that happen. And of course, it's a great pleasure of honor to introduce someone today who's a great champion of agriculture in every part of Ontario, our colleague, your Premier, Kathleen Wynne. It's great to be here with you, Burkhardt. We were talking about the first time we uh, did an event together. We were in a school and we were talking about fresh local food going to uh, kids in schools. So, uh, so there, uh, there's a theme running throughout our, our relationship and I really appreciate the work that you do with the, with the Green Belt. We need to remember that 10 years ago, urban sprawl was threatening to destroy the farmlands and forests that make the GTHA so livable. And it's why our government created the Green Belt in the first place. That was the, uh, that was the motivator. And today, Ontario's Green Belt is the largest permanently protected Green Belt in the world, home to 5,500 farms and some of the best farmland in the whole country. And as this region continues to be one of the fastest growing on the continent, we plan to enhance and expand the Green Belt so that this precious resource continues to be protected. And a nonprofit doing terrific work to promote local food and agriculture across our province is the Green, Green Belt Fund. You've done a huge amount. And that's why I'm pleased to announce today that our government will invest six million dollars over three years for the Green Belt Fund to increase the sales of Ontario grown food. Because of the work you've done, we want you to continue doing that work, Burkhart. This investment will support projects that make Ontario food widely available and it will support the creation of new tools on OntarioFresh.ca, the Greenbelt Fund's online platform, to make it easier for local food buyers and sellers to connect. Thank you very much everyone for making our uh, agriculture uh, story such a successful one and Burkhart, thank you very much for the work that you're doing in the Greenbelt Fund. Merci.